We'll be starting in just a second here. Give us one moment. All right, welcome to the late night hearth, everyone. Hey, how you doing, Yo. guys? <laughs> hey guys, it's your boy, Killer King. We Kings titled this one correctly here. this time. I'm straight from Boston. I'm tired to tell you that Eric is straight daddy material. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> hey, cool, <laughs> I'm clipping that. Hey, You're Tony, welcome. dad, dad. I mean, Xbox Chief, can you be my. <laughs> <laughs> so, we are off we, to a we great were start, folks. Oh how, my god. Um, we were talking about how Eric has like a very soft singing voice, and then I said, oh. He's straight daddy material. <laughs> like actual dad, not that, you know. Okay, anyways, Eric, go ahead. Oh, we've also established that everything that comes out of Tony's mouth is somehow sexual. sexual. Yeah. <laughs> Take that as you will. Bitch will choke on broccoli and the broccoli will come out moaning. Like... <laughs> God damn it. God, we're only a minute in and we're already laughing our asses off. Oh this is going to be a God. great episode. All right, so, we, so... We haven't, we right, haven't right, gone right. a minute without referencing porn. <laughs> no, we didn't talk about porn yet. We talked about loot Red, things, but we didn't say out. porn. All right, so we're, we we do have quite the lineup here tonight. We we do have a busy schedule for this next hour and a half. Um, so on the lineup tonight, we do have a visual game. So if you are listening, uh, we'll tell you when to tune in to the visual side on Twitch. Um, it and then we also have Jeopardy, right? Which audio based game. Um, but we're gonna start off with. How was our week? Jason, how was your week? It was good. What'd you Hold do? on. Tony, what the fuck? Wait, my friend died. My friend's sister dyed her uh, eyebrows orange. <laughs> she died. Cool, we needed to know that. Anyway, moving I on. It was, I thought it was like weird talking off. Like, my boy's girlfriend died. I'm my like, friend's <laughs> sister died. <laughs> 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 That's what anyway, I thought. Jason, I thought. Anyway, Jay, I ahead. thought he was about to end that died as well. Not gonna lie. All right. Same. Wait, what? <laughs> My friend's sister died. <laughs> I actually thought oh, he was, I thought he was about to say my sister died and I'm like oh my god oh my <laughs> sister god. Yeah. yeah why I'm, did I'm you get a point, sister I'm going to point out that on stream we have only been live for like three, three minutes, minutes. Three minutes. Two, and no, we probably like, have like five clips minutes. already <laughs> two minutes from me and we've already fucking shot the shit okay good night everybody podcast is ending we're out no <laughs> shut the fuck up anyways uh Ro <laughs> like comment jason, subscribe. jason how was your how's your yeah week? yeah how, how was your week jay i thought it was good <laughs> so that it that, that, that it, it you're like good you until tony first? said my i mean like <laughs> I'm, I'm starting to grow a goatee <laughs> oh god Welcome oh to my yeah we saw oh, that's good goatee i guess but other than that, I mean, visiting colleges, that's it. I mean, Where'd you go? Uh, just I guess Brandon is now the host. Asking all these Look at Brandon taking charge of the of Eric's podcast. Way to go. He's asking the question. <laughs> you know, the material. <laughs> God damn it, Tony. I need right. to stop. I need to fucking stop. What, what did Tony say? <laughs> What did Tony say? <laughs> Taking over Mr. Daddy material. Oh my god. <laughs> Don't worry, I, I have the dad attitude and, and Brandon has the dad bod. No. <laughs> when you put the two the together, attitude. you get dad. No. <laughs> dad has arrived. We, we, me, me, I need, I need, I need a version of Brandon. Like, I need you him just, to mouth just, things and them. I just talk. Like, while he's mouthing. <laughs> I you just hear Eric. Kids. You just hear Eric say, "Are you winning, son?" <laughs> that's, that's Ryan in the future. His son will be what? looking at hentai, and he'll be like, "Curses!" He watched the old winning? podcast. <laughs> no, he, he, he's got the daditude for that one. <laughs> I mean, I am anyway. a boomer, so. Oh anyway, God. Jason, where do yeah. you visit? Yeah. I went Almost. to East Stroudsburg, and I went to um. Uh, Booms Bloomsburg. So, so what, what's your opinion of Philly? them? Oh my God, they're not both in. Philly. Um, I mean, every college was explained the same way. Like, hey, we're good. We have this, this, blah, blah, blah. So, how um, much bullshit did you see through? How much bullshit? That <laughs> well, um, 
Like, sorry, say that again? How much, How much bullshit? bullshit did you have to see through to get the truth? Oh, uh, um, the tuition goes up every year. They oh, that sounds that. great. For Bloomberg. <laughs> um, the area for, I didn't, I don't, I don't like East Stroudsburg's area. Yeah. Like Why is that? It's just kind of old. Bloomsburg's nice though, but it's a little bit pricier. Mm -hmm. I mean, pricier, like a couple grand more. And that's really it. I mean, every, they, they all explained it the same, you know? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. This like is where you'll have, achieve your hopes and dreams. We have a like shit that. ton of Starbucks. We have, <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. That was their yeah. selling point? They must have looked at you and been like, oh, it's a white kid. We need to sell him with our <laughs> yeah, Starbucks. We have Chick fil A. <laughs> we cool, have Chick fil A. Too. Uh, what's it called? Um, another bullshit thing they said was about the. Freshmen have to go into, like, I guess a freshman kind of dorm. But you wouldn't be a yeah, chef. I'm a trans. Yeah, you're uh, a trans I'm yeah, a transfer student, so you're I want to be with all juniors. There's no, like, transfer, like, I don't, like, I don't dorm with transfer students in Bloomsburg. Oh. And East Stroudsburg, I do. So if I went to Bloomsburg, I would have to be with just juniors. Which is not necessarily a bad thing, but... I mean, no. That's probably better. Yeah. In all honesty. Don't be around the dumb freshman. <laughs> no, no, no. It's either being with juniors or transfer students. Oh, no, okay, I, okay. I do not want to be with freshmen. I was going to say, I don't know about your, the freshmen there, but our freshmen are fucking infested. With what? Exactly what you'd expect. STDs? And? <laughs> and lice. And? Cat girls. And cat girl! Oh cat girl. Uh, no. We I must mean, eradicate all the cat girls. There's one hiding in Tony's dorm. Tony has no. one locked in his room. <laughs> You'll never take her alive! Turns out it is Tony. It is Tony. Oh my God. What the fuck? Oh my God. Anyways, I'm pretty you don't sure. have to run away. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> they just they just throw catnip at Tony's face and he just like rolls over. <laughs> oh my god. Any, any, oh they, my probably, god. they probably have COVID. Oh <laughs> my <laughs> god. Alright, alright. <laughs> well, we're, <laughs> we're gonna move on to Brandon. Brandon, how was your week? My week was pretty cool. Yeah, pretty how cool. so? Um, so, hmm. I can't really remember. Uh, oh, that's grand. <laughs> oh, so this week, and I was pretty much modding more guitars. I just bought, I, I in fact, I bought something from a, a website, uh, Indra Guitars. I'm not sure if I covered that last podcast. I think you did. Indra, the new pickguard? Yep, you did. Uh, yeah, okay, did. we talked. Okay. Yeah, and in fact, you even taught us how to online shop. <laughs> Oh yeah, I if did. I remember I correctly. I shop online. Alright, I also updated like... Yeah, we already know about the mods that I did. So I'm just gonna shut up about that. Um, <laughs> so basically... I'm Why not remind the viewers? You know, so, we yeah, might have we might have some first-time viewers tuning in. Alright, so I did mod a bunch of my guitars. Um, uh, three, did you J-tag it? Three of them, actually. Um, <laughs> you didn't hear me. Oh, tag the guitars. Did you J-tag it? I didn't JTAG my guitars. <laughs> no. um, uh, I bought a Strat, an SG with new tuners and pretty much a lot of new parts. You bought a Fender? Like a Strat? Um, it's like a Aria Pro 2 Super Strat uh. that I'm modding. It's like the one that took stripes on it. They keep showing. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's yeah. All yeah. Right. Um, and I also got some new like cosmetic stuff for my uh, Les Paul. That, and those are cool stuff. So, yeah, cool beans with that. You mean cosmetics uh, like camos? <laughs> camos. No, plastic <laughs> surgery. No, just nice stuff, uh, nice stuff. He got a golden uh, weapon. <laughs> oh, was... One of them is golden. You're not wrong about that. Speaking it's of been... like modding shit, this will be quick, I promise. No, no, go ahead. The original ahead. Xbox I have, Brandon, mm -hmm. I haven't turned it on in a while, so I decided to give it like, just turn it on to see how it sounds. 
And the thing sounded like it almost freaking exploded. <laughs> oh, oh god. god. The CPU fan is dying, so when I turn it on, it's like <laughs> oh my god. I should you not. That, you, you could fucking put that thing out in the lawn, it would cut the grass for you. <laughs> I have to replace. I should try that, dude. I have to replace the fan on it. It doesn't sound good. Damn. All right. Anyway, sorry. Just go to the fucking so... LTTstore.com, knock to a fan. An easy clap, dude. What? More just open the case yeah. and put like an air conditioner over it. <laughs> <laughs> just do, just do the shit with the like people in Florida do with like their cars. They fucking bust the window out. They fucking cover it up a little bit and they attach an AC unit to their car. <laughs> Dear God. So... They have, people do do that. It's hilarious. Uh, more information about this week for me is that I have a bit of a spending problem with Amazon. Uh, so That's this a week, mood. Uh, yep. Um, <laughs> not only did I buy um, a gift for my good friend and this um, awesome host, Explo Sheep. Yeah, um, he got me strings parrot. and they send it to the wrong address. Did you get him? <laughs> no, he sent it to a dress that doesn't even exist. So you didn't get him yet? No. We, I have no idea what the fuck they yeah. are. Hey, all, all I'm going to say is you probably oh, shouldn't you send your address here, uh, on the podcast. Oh, fuck. Bruh. <laughs> oh, shit. Wait, no, no, that's not my address. It's the wrong address. That's not his address. Yeah. No, oh, that's not yeah. his address. No. That's yeah, the no, wrong address. address. I've actually never been to his place, so I wouldn't know. Yeah. My address oh, is. <laughs> my address is. We should probably bleed that out on YouTube, dude. My, my address is 420. It's a hint. It's Nickel not a hint. It's not a hint. My friend Brandon's just stupid. <laughs> oh my god, that's so mean. Oh my god, I'm, I'm terribly sorry about that. Uh, it's gonna be like. Uh, we, uh, I need to cut it, it out. Like, t you some guys are gonna come to your house. And you're like, do I really gotta do this? <laughs> Dude, this is what this is what happens. We start out high and then we just crash. <laughs> oh my! Uh, and, then, and then we so come back. My spending problem with Amazon. Let's continue on that. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yes. Let me just take a look at all the other Amazon purchases I have. Well, while, while you look at that, I'm just gonna say I bought something on Amazon today. It's a huge thing. I bought plant, plant pots. <laughs> Yes, I want. <laughs> so I'm bringing my driving like, tomorrow. Yeah. Is a new webcam that I'm getting for my other computer. Nice. Even uh, though we don't use webcams. <laughs> I know we don't not use webcams here. No, but Brandon does. If you want to join his OnlyFans, <laughs> <laughs> or if you just want to be in voice chat with us, at yeah, any he'll day, just uh, he'll strip at random. You'll, you'll, you'll typically see him shirt. <laughs> Yeah, he'll just he'll just be like, oh, it's too hot in here," and start stripping. <laughs> it's getting hot. Hey, more thing about this week is that I started to do a new weird diet plan called intermittent fasting. Basically, I'm not eating anything after dinner, and I'm skipping breakfast, which is interesting to me. And that basically the. Basically, the philosophy behind this is that there's an 18-minute window. No, there's an 8-minute window. Sorry. Where I can eat as much as I want, and there's a 16-minute window where I'm just fasting. And supposedly, at the I... latter end of that 16-minute window, my body's supposed to go into a state called uh, ketosis. Yeah, which your body would go into if you exercised. Yeah. So how yeah. often do you exercise? <laughs> Is a ketosis is a process when my body doesn't have enough carbs to burn energy? Instead, it uses fat. Yeah. They use it for food. That's what keto is, isn't it? Yeah, it's keto. Yeah. yeah, that's keto. That's why. That's why it's like a, a huge fat-based diet with no carbs. Mm -hmm. Because yeah. you eat a lot of fat, and that. Really <laughs> you, I, I, I don't really fat? think about keto, ah. like when I was like running and stuff. But I'm not really running this so much. Yeah. So I'm trying to do whatever I can. Plus, like skipping bre skipping breakfast for a little bit. By the and, way, Tony, like, I wouldn't be worried that any of your college friends are watching right now. Why? Oh, you, you guys are fucking dumb. Okay. I, w I wouldn't be concerned about it. Currently, why? <laughs> currently, our view count does not show that anyone. I, I understand <laughs> that, but there's. Oh my god! I'll fucking tell you later. <laughs> Wait, is it about the two girls next door? No, you guys are fucking dumb! 
<laughs> you guys are fucking dumb. Anyway, that's that's it. I'm just gonna shut up. No, no, no you're you're, you're fine. More keep going. Yeah, that's fair. yeah, no, Brandon, you're good. Yeah, just, we'll, just, we'll, we'll, we'll that was it. Oh, okay, that was it. Dad, that's being fucking dumb. So, so I'm gonna. I mean, already we we've given a hint about my address and <laughs> which we're gonna cut out. Hey, we we just said the street name and the number. We didn't give the town name. Okay. Also, we didn't say it was the correct street, which it's not. Exactly. Um, he didn't even send it to the right street. It was, oh my god. Uh, oh, so, so I, oh, I'm fucking stupid. I so I just wasted thirty bucks. <laughs> I, I I have no I fucking idea how to get any of that stuff back. Oh, don't worry. They legally can't open it. It has my name on it, so they're gonna probably send it back to Amazon. Send it back? Yeah, it's a federal offense to open someone else's mail. Oh. The more you know, which means you don't go to jail. You go to federal <laughs> prison. <laughs> Um, uh, so... Is that better or worse? That's worse. <laughs> the anus expanding prison. Right. The fuck? <laughs> that's where they train you to take on... You think the law will stop them? Yeah, I do. Because if, if Eric finds out the package was opened, he can basically be like, Ha! You're going to jail, bitch! <laughs> you know that one clip of, um... What, what's her face? Potaskic... Potaskic P, uh, Jenny from MX. Did you have a stroke? Yeah, I did. Uh, <laughs> Potaskic P, uh, from MX Plays. She has a button. I'm going to jail. That that's gonna be me. You're going to jail. Um. <laughs> <laughs> uh, anyway. Uh, do I think it will legitimately stop them? Maybe. We'll see. I'm uh, waiting I for went... the rest of Kichi Curse. Anyway. So I'm gonna, <laughs> since since we were talking about Amazon, and and I brought up that I'm getting pots for my, for plants. I'm bringing my herb garden in for the winter. And I'm probably just gonna keep it in the bay window, keep it inside. So I'm gonna have fresh herbs always, which is really nice. <laughs> By so the way, my oregano pot. plant is so big. My aunt was like, "Oh yeah, so five inch potter will be fine for it." And I'm <laughs> like, "I highly doubt that." And she's like, "I guarantee it'll be big enough." Only a fourth of the plant fit in. Jeez. That's how big my oregano plant is. Jesus <laughs> Christ. Hey, just saying, Ryan, look at the one in Discord. Look at the one you posted. You yeah, done I fucked up, bud. I don't care. <laughs> wait, wait, what? Okay, whatever. <laughs> anyway, let's move on I don't to Tony's. Know. I don't Tony's know what he's on about. Besides us mentioning um, certain <laughs> things on the podcast... That we really shouldn't have. <laughs> that you are now mad about. <laughs> How is your week? You guys are still bringing it up indirectly. You guys fucking killed me. What are you talking about? I have no idea what you're talking about. Ah, for fuck's sake. Anyways. Yeah, how the uh, do you still really have mad. Do you still have that <laughs> wallpaper on your on your on your computer? No. <laughs> <laughs> no, don't, don't even fuck into, with This just turned into Roast Tony episode of the podcast. And you know what? It happens to me all the fucking time. <laughs> I deal with it. I'm fucking tired of it. I fucking deal with it. No matter who it is, no matter who, who the fucking, who the fuck's doing it. Yeah, it's if we literally ro- always me. If we roast him, he just sends Neko butt. <laughs> I tried yeah. using my your emotes in my server, and you went ape shit on me. Yeah, because they're not because they're not fucking fair use. You're, you're now you're acting like I'm about to go to freaking what the Eric said, federal prison. prison for using Neko Bud. No, but no, I'm saying you could <laughs> fucking you could get the server banned. Anyway, anyway, anyway. anyway. I'm use. fucking dying. All right, all right, let's it's bring it back. PNG. Eric, 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 Eric. <laughs> let's bring day? it back. God. Eric, how's your week? <laughs> what about Tony's week? What about? Oh well, you got to Tony, Tony. Ryle will keep it Tony, cold down. Tony, 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 cold down. Tony, how was your week? No, no. Tony, how was your week? Uh, yeah. Honestly, same as always. always. Really nothing happened. There's there's literally the, been Aren't there a few assholes that outside that constantly rev their engine? There, yeah, there's always a few assholes outside. What happened? Uh, they fucking drive down the street at like 1 in the morning blasting fucking... <laughs> 
No, 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 no. What the fuck is he doing? Wait, what? It, it was a fucking mumble rap, dude. Like, uh, I, I shit you not, That's that stuff shakes my entire. <laughs> And he goes, <laughs> No, Brandon, you're doing it wrong. It's more <laughs> Dude, Brandon, our favorite is Bobby Two <laughs> Bobby oh, nice. Two Do not look that up. Again. Do not look that up. <laughs> I, I shit you not. Sometimes the bass is so excessively loud, I can hear it shaking their car and then fucking shaking the metal in my building. Is it like if I bass boosted my voice? Wait, no, yes. it's worse. Still oh, alone God. in your dorm? Yeah, I'm still alone. I, I, I want to be alone. I don't want any fucking dumbass person in here. Are you yeah, like imagine, imagine in how- your apartment? Huh? Are you like the only person in your apartment? Yep. That's right. Really imagine serious. Tony not Ima being alone. I'm not I'm, joking. Imagine Wait. Tony not being alone. He would annoy his, his, his roommate by playing League. <laughs> Wait, so Tony, like- Jay, oh, I guess I'm the only one in there. Yes, it's a How it's the a hell quad. do you do it, dude? It's literally a quad apartment. Tony. I'm the only one here. <laughs> and then just, like run insane. around shirtless around the whole apartment. That's <laughs> exactly. Oh my god. So Tony doesn't own one room. He owns the entire complex. No, I actually, <laughs> no. So here's the thing. I I get the common room to myself. Who exercises to myself? I get my room to myself, but I don't get the other room. No. Okay. So here's because the thing. Because it's locked. No, you're gonna you're gonna find a way to pick that lock, and then they're gonna send in another student, and they're gonna be like, "Who the fuck set up?" And then Tony's gonna walk in, he's like, "Oh, that's my gaming room, dude." Oh hi. <laughs> I, I will literally, I will like not recognize the person. Like, here's here's what's gonna go down. If I'll get an, a notification from my RA that someone's gonna be moving in, I'll see this motherfucker move in. I'll get my sword or my fucking bow, take aim, and be like, "What the fuck are you doing in my apartment? Why are you here?" Leave now, or I'm gonna fucking slice you. you, guys, you okay, guys I think we shiny? mentioned. I think we mentioned a lot less worse things about you than the thing Yo. that you just said. Yo, Eric, <laughs> you literally admitted that you would possibly kill someone. Eric, well, I, yeah, so I, I'd be fucking terrified. I don't know who it is. <laughs> Eric, yeah. You ever watched The Shining? No. Damn it. <laughs> oh, nope. Shit. I wish Casey was here. Casey probably watched it. He Here's... definitely has. I watched The Shining. All right, Brandon, you watch it. Here's Tony. I could see Tony being the the main guy. Johnny. Because he's all alone in the apartment. Oh, when he gets that one person, he's gonna go crazy. Like, whoever, Jack Tony. <laughs> whoever Jack Nicholson's character is. Here's, Here's Tony. Johnny. And he's just gonna knock it. Red out. Rum. Red Rum. Oh my God. <laughs> all right. Let's move on to Ryan's week. Hey. Um, my week was kind of uneventful. So. All right, cool. Let's move on to my week. <laughs> <laughs> well, hold on. I did. There's something interesting. Yeah. So, obviously, I've annoyed the shit out of you guys about this one guitar that I really want, and I found it. Did you? Used. I didn't notice. Yeah, I found it. I found, <laughs> I found a used one of it for a much lower price than what it was selling for on another website uh on guitar setting so that's about it thanks uh, one more thing about me i know i took a lot of time but i also found a awesome instrument that i want to share with the world something i might get it's called the ass harp <laughs> <laughs> yes you play it with you, the cheeks. you pluck it you pluck your your ass hair <laughs> it's this bad no. boy that's actually really nice it if is. you are totally just like listening, you can. One. If you are just listening, you can tune in to the visual side of the podcast here on twitch.tv slash sheep underscore to view this beautiful bass that my amazing bassist is showing us. Yes, thank you very much for all the kind effort. Um, let me show up the spec sheet over here just in case you guys want to do it, if you want to even care. Um, we have any fingerboard, uh, flame maple body. Uh, actually, no, Flame People Veneer, Basswood Body, uh, Ebony Fingerboard, Bone Nut. I don't think they custom need all the pickups. Specs. Bone Nut. Wait, 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 wait. While you're on Google, last time we teased that you would teach us how to use Google. 
Now how he's shot. Okay. Now okay. He's, how to now shop? He's how to That's shop? Car. Add the car. Oh my God! Is he buying the base? Please don't. I'm not gonna buy this right now. But you view cart. Put in all your credit card information, like so. Like <laughs> <laughs> credit card information live on stream. Yeah. No. I don't have the money right now. Yeah. <laughs> all right. All right. Let's That's move not... back. All right. How was your week, Expo Sheep? Um. My name's Eric, not Explosive, but yes, I do run the channel called Explosive. Brandon, you know this. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. My God, you've been friends with him for how long? Oh, so, only two anyway. weeks. We met two weeks ago. Um, anyway, so, okay. Mr. What's your username, Instagram username, Eric is the Explosive. Yeah. Tony. Your week? <laughs> my, my, Yo, Tony. My... <laughs> oh my Tony. God, Jesus. Yo, I have a serious question. Since you're all alone in that apartment, could you bring the boys over? No, I'd get, uh, I'd get You couldn't expelled. have asked this five minutes ago? Oh, you'd get expelled? I, I, well, not expelled. I'd be dismissed. Because I, I can't have anyone else uh, in my apartment other than people who are living in this building. Damn it. No. I, 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 if I could, I would. That but would be the all, all, all I'm saying is I, I'd, I, I would have to somehow find a way to fit. Well, first off, I'd have to figure out who the hell gets the other bed. Someone has to bring bed sheets. Who has? Someone needs to bring a fucking blow up bed. Someone gets a uh, part of the couch. Someone gets the other part of the couch. And if I can break, break into the other fucking room, they get uh, both beds. And the real Christ, question is, where is that? Holy and, fuck! And the real <laughs> and, and the and the real question is, who's bringing the blow up doll? What? <laughs> I didn't know. <laughs> you, you fuck! I said, and the real question is, is who's bringing the blow up doll? <laughs> well, I think he said, who's bringing the blow up doll? Well, there you go. <laughs> Amazon's bringing. And he was shit. blowing. Tony. Amaz no. <laughs> <laughs> Amazon's bringing it, and, and it's the delivery man who's blowing. <laughs> Anyways, Eric, how was your week? <laughs> Wait, Tony wants to say something now. Uh, no, I don't. First off, I'm not blowing. I'm straight as fuck. Yeah, someone... You heard it here first. Guys. You heard it here first, guys. Yeah, Tony is straight. <laughs> anyway, Eric, yeah. how was your week, my friend? Uh, my friend, my week was fine. Uh, I need to get off my ass and finally do some 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 schoolwork. But besides doing schoolwork, uh, How about now again? I don't think I'm cutting out on stream. My audio levels are fine. I think it's a Discord. Oh yeah, he's thing. He's, he's not going to cut out on stream. He's only going to cut out for us. So I'm just gonna keep talking, and you guys are gonna have to fill in the gaps. You can play Mad Libs with my words. Fuck um, you too. Okay. So, uh, so, so I ran I a meme challenge. This, input sensitivity a lot. So I, I ran a meme challenge this week. That was really fun. Sorry, I actually you ran a meme challenge, and that was really fun. Yeah, look at that. We're getting through this together, guys. Uh, God. All right. So. Uh. So besides that, my week was perfectly fine. I, I didn't do much this week, I'm not going to lie. Uh, so, speaking, just moving on from the this week uh, segment, let, let's let's move on to hentai or not. How's that? <laughs> All right, that was the quickest transition we've ever done on this show. Yeah. Like, I, I, like, I, just, I just wanted to get out of this. No, no, shut so, up. It wasn't smooth. So I know it wasn't up. smooth. I don't, I don't know why, but I think everyone is just in heat at this point because literally no, like 50%, 50 to 70% of this podcast is, has just been dirty in one way or another. Yeah, no shit. You're on it. Yeah, I mean, yeah. let's, <laughs> yeah, but let's I'm, be I'm real. I'm not making all the comments. I'm impressed. <laughs> it's, not, it's not entirely me for once, you fuckheads. Whoa, but it's still mostly that. you. <laughs> Anyway, we're gonna get into hentai or not. Uh, All right. So, mm. I am currently. All right, switching. A uh, winning son. I also think Dan has got me addicted to Warhammer. Believe it or not. Oh God. Yeah, I'm. I'm actually. It's All right. A Oh, I'll stop. We need to be more organized. This is no, 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 no. It's perfectly fine. We're actually fine. Tony, yeah. it's wait, hold on. 
Wait. Our disorganization is what makes it funny. <laughs> no, no, no. Right. You, act you actually can't see it because I'm in studio net mode, okay? What? You can't see me switching shit around because I'm in studio mode. Ah. Oh, yeah. you son of a bitch! Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. All right. That Transition. Welcome to Hentai or Not. <laughs> How do you watch the stream for this? Wait, yeah, no, you you, you want to watch the stream for this? It's it's. And, and, and we're, just, and we're just gonna I'm say to. um, there is a mature content warning. The, like, uh, there's a mature content warning on this. On yeah, this but stream. even more mature. Like seriously. Yeah, seriously mature content warning. Okay. Like, think about the first five minutes. Whoa! Of <laughs> Dab, Titan VP just subscribed with his Prime membership. Let's go, boys. Yeah, boys. <laughs> Thanks, Brandon. <laughs> Very Love, cool. Bro. All right, we're gonna get into hentai or not. All right. Oh. So that the moment of realization, for Jason. <laughs> so the... oh, so... I, I, I died. Uh, oh, are you playing a video game on the podcast again? Yeah, I'm playing Breath of the Wild, so it's not like I'm just okay. Like, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah. That's fine. Uh, okay. All right. I'm playing Breath of the Wild. That's technically not gaming. <laughs> no. Like... All right. So. So the premise of this game is there will be an anime image that pops up. You're going to have to guess if it's anime or if it's hentai. And keep track of your own damn scores, okay? Because I'm if you are under 18, quickly turn off the podcast now. Don't worry, no <laughs> boobs are shown. You're fine. And if you are under 13, I'm going to have to ban you. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Ready? First image. Oh, uh, hentai. Me this I watched the stuff Tony watched when he was. No, there. this is not a hentai. <laughs> this is either hentai or fairy tale. This doesn't. This doesn't seem like a hentai. I don't know what it is, but this. Oh is no, I've seen hentai. hentais that are this high quality. No, I, I don't guess. watch. Oh my god, <laughs> Ben, I understand that, but this is this is not. I don't think hentai. it is. All right. Just so, final final I mean, conclusion. Switch, but... Okay. Okay. How many people are for hentai? Me. Okay. <laughs> Wait, hold on, hold All on. Right. How many people bitch. are for anime? I'm for anime, bitch. All right, it's an anime. It's called Monster I Girl Doctor. I fucking told it. <laughs> also, anime I anime. fucking told you, bitches. Yeah, hentai is anime porn. Eric, yes. Don't Eric, don't phrase it as who's for hentai. <laughs> no, I'm totally gonna do that, so I can get a bunch of clips of you guys saying I'm for hentai. <laughs> uh, that's gonna be a, that's gonna be a compilation of its own. Who's for hentai? And we stupidly say me. All right. Next one. Oh, this is this is not a this is not a hentai. I know this one. Uh, yeah, it's not a hentai. Yeah, I anime. think I've seen this anime. This, uh, this is an amazing. Well, yeah, it was good. This is <laughs> Jason. What's what's your vote? Uh, it's anime. This is the thirstiest girl in all of anime. It is amazing. Anime. He, Sh Shimonetta, Shimonetta so a boring world where the concept of dirty jokes doesn't exist. <laughs> The full title. Be, so One good. day we're gonna have a guest on the podcast who's gonna be like, I see big anime titties, so I'm just gonna assume it's all hentai. It's gonna be Kayla. We should get uh, a guest on the show. What? We should get a guest on the show. Yeah, we should. I'd be down for that. We got the guests. Uh, so, all right, into the next one. Oh, God. Um, That's a hentai. Hentai or anime? Hold on, let me think. I have a strange and scary oh, feeling no. that it's a hentai. Part of me wants to say this is an anime. Right. Eric, but, 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 no, but, but knowing Eric's uh, algorithm of PowerPoint presentations, this is a hentai. Yeah, it's probably mm -hmm. a hentai, yeah. Watch them, watch them all just be anime and he's just fucking with us. Alright, this, like one, is a, this one is a hentai. Where's my Libra? Called it. Yeah. Me, me you from I Star Can. I have no idea. I've never watched this. I, I literally looked up. I went to an incognito tab and I'm like, hentai characters. And I picked up the first few non NSFW photos. Um, <laughs> all right. We should do clips. All one. right. What's this one? Oh, God. Gee, this, is a a this is a hentai. Therefore, <laughs> I'm going with Tony. This is the, this is the the image that Eric sent to me earlier. Uh, oh, no. hentai. This is a hentai. This is an anime. How what not the to fuck? This is how what? not to summon a demon lord. <laughs> Tony. It's all the same. Tonight. You assume that because it's a cat. <laughs> <laughs> well, hold it. Well, don't fucking follow my answer. They it's only like follow your answer. Like a, they like they a... look at you as the expert, Tony. 
It's not like <laughs> we got three out of four correct. All right. Based on logic. All right. How about this one? This is, a, this is an anime. Uh -huh. Anime, anime, because they're covering uh, all the junks. They're covering yeah, the think, penis. I think it's an anime. Uh, if, it, if it was a... A hentai, there wouldn't be bubbles there. This Fair is enough. a hentai. Oh, God. Dude. Oh, fuck. fuck. I should have stuck with my first thing. It's a kai hero monogatari. It's a fucking hero. So eventually <laughs> those bubbles move. <laughs> <laughs> no, the bubbles just... Or they, they suck on the bubbles. Oh, my God. Stop. Anyways. Oh, my God. This one. I want to say... I think that one's a... Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's a hentai. Uh, hold on. Are the... Actually, no, I. Books in the background. Change my answer. It's, I think it's an anime. Because he's too nice. Frick okay, yeah, guess what, Brandon? Frickin Books can be deceiving. I'm gonna stick with hentai. Fr <laughs> Frickin' to Tony's like, there's books in the background. According to my logic and reasoning, something <laughs> something algorithm about all hentai I've ever seen. This is an anime. <laughs> but I'm wrong. This is a hentai. See? Mm. Victorian maid Maria. I fucking knew. I, I, I love I how Jason's been silent. I love how Jason's been silent it's fine. this whole game. No, I, I just, I don't. <laughs> I, they all, they all look the same to me. It's just guess. Yeah, exactly. That's yeah. the fun of it. Just guess. It's the fun of it. All right. Anime. This one. Oh, this one's oh, an anime. For I know. Fuck's sake, this is. I feel like this is Sao, isn't it? Maybe. What is um, she? What is she pleading for? Uh, um, hidden horse cock. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> anime. Anime. It's an anime. Uh, it's a hentai. Jay. Not a hentai. Jay. I know anime. Uh, it's fucking uh, Sao yeah, Ryan. Ryan. If you didn't get this, Ryan. you one, you are lying about it being your favorite anime. I never said it was my favorite anime. Yes, you I did. Just said my... You said it multiple times, yes. No, I said it's the first anime I got. No, you literally into. told me. You were like, I said it was my favorite an anime because it's the first anime I've gotten into. That was your exact answer every single time. Oh, was it? <laughs> yeah. That's kind of like me saying Dragon Ball Z is my favorite anime because it's your first anime Dragon I've ever Ball watched. Dragon Ball Z was great, though. Yeah, it was. It was overrated. All right, last Fuck one. Fuck you. <laughs> uh, hentai. No. God, fucking no. damn it, Eric. Hold on, hold on. I gotta do something in chat real quick. Is that masturbate? Hold on. No. <laughs> oh. Wait, what? How would he do that in chat? I don't know. <laughs> I can't curse that image. <laughs> yeah, no. This is a this is a visual novel. Exactly. It's a visual novel. <laughs> it's not even an anime. Actually, what's funny is I think I got. I still got like four. How many were there here? Game. We sped ran this last night with an auto clicker just to get a 100% click completed game. By the way, the the final achievement was you hitting 100% stress levels, and then you being you being this bitch beating out another girl. Beating on that one. Well, yeah. it was really, really. It was dark. It was. Really we skipped. We skipped. Dark. We skipped like through everything, and then right at the end, we're like, wait, what the fuck? Yeah. Anyway, that was hentai. That was hentai or not? Hold so on, oh, Eric. Um, how many did you put in? What do you mean? How like many what? I put eight. In? Yeah, it wasn't that many. Oh, so it was yeah. like six out of eight for me. I guess. Yeah. Yeah, that was that was like a speed run. Easy clap, dude. Really um, okay. So we got about twenty more minutes. You guys want to just like chill for a little bit, and then we uh, twenty we minutes. No, we don't have twenty minutes. We're currently hitting no. forty. So no, we have, we have twenty about... minutes till break. Um, yeah, that's what, what I meant. Which, so which, means, thing. which means we get to play Jeopardy. That's, da, what, I na, 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 that's what I was na, going on about, but yeah. Alright, here we go. I'll screen that. Let me share my screen with you guys. Make sure it's not your video. Make sure it's, it's not your, your oh, hentai hater. Um, I think you I missed a I, question? Uh, I think I missed a question. Yeah, uh, F1. Oh, no. Bruh, how F11. the fuck? Continue. Muzak? Oh, what the... Muzak? Oh, okay, I get... <laughs> oh, okay, 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 okay. Oh, my God. 
I think I screwed up a little bit. Who the we'll fuck just, is we'll all right, all right, whatever. Let's whatever. just protect this question. Is um, it's there. Funny. It's there. It's there. All right. Yeah. So all we right. have five uh, separate. Um... By the way, can you guys hear the music that's going through my headphones right now? No. 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 That's not how. Because it's going work. through your fucking headphones. <laughs> okay. So we have five categories: Muzak, which is kind of music trivia. No, it's Muzak. Which is various levers of gamer trivia. Um, yes, I'm serious. <laughs> math. Yes, I'm serious. It's math. You spooky, figure it out from there. Scary. Spooky, scary questions. Uh, questions about you know spooky and scary stuff, and inside jokes from both the household of Hestia, and a band oh, dear called God. Feedback that lies within. No. I'm scared about oh, one of the inside jokes that might be on there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so. Yeah. Well, that's again. <laughs> Um, so who's going uh, first? Well, I should probably have a spinning wheel to see who wants to go first. Or you can just go alphabetical. Just go alphabetical. All right, Eric, you first. Right. That's. I'll take. Yeah. Wait, wait. How do we buzz in? You don't. I can hear someone else myself through someone else's. That's my fault. Sorry. Okay. Okay. So I'm gonna take Muzak for 100. Jason, where's the Oasis? Oasis. Oasis. What is Oasis? I think Eric got it first. Can we all just go oh, point at this one? Sure. Yeah. You know, yeah, that's that's fair. We all said it. Y'all want to get points for that one? They, yeah. Or whoever got said I'm it fine. first. I'm fine with Kyle. Well, I, I'm pretty sure I'm the one who said it first. Let's all just get points, to be fair. What is Oasis? No, I'm pretty sure I said it first, you bitch. I'm the one sure. who buzzed all in. All right, all right. Eric gets it. All right. Eric, the next one. <laughs> bitch. Um... Math, yes, I'm serious for 500. That's oh, 100. 500. Oh, oh, fuck. Well, oh, okay, I mean, okay, 500. Brandon. What is the indefinite integral of 3x? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Plus 6x squared plus 4x plus, plus 7. Plus, 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 you can't. I actually have to do this. Hey, Brandon. Pause. 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 What the fuck yourself? Is, is this is this integrals or is this factoring? Because this is depending no, on how this is integrate. No, this is integration. Well, no. fuck. I don't. I don't think calculus. No, it's not pre-algebra. This is fucking like calc two shit. All right. Well, I don't take calc, so fuck you. All right. All right, you guys. Gonna really want to give it. All right, Eric. What's your answer? Why? Why this is up to me? Uh, <laughs> because you, act, you chose it. X, you're the smart one. X equals 273. Um, Ryan, what's your answer? I don't fucking know. Jason, what's your answer? Undefined. Tony, what's your answer? Dude, if I'm gonna be for real, it's gonna be something stupid like one. Nope. It is four. What the fuck is, is that? Four, four, Brandon, four, this is why you don't make Jeopardy. Plus two oh x squared oh, plus okay. seven x. Let's, All right. let's, point out, let's point out that this game of Jeopardy was rushed by our good friend Brandon. This, he literally made this uh, in twenty fucking minutes. All right. He made this in two hours. What are you talking about? <laughs> two hours. I don't give a Anyways, fuck. Anyways, Eric, you you got the last one right, so you get to choose the next one. Spooky, scary questions for two hundred. Okay. Look, this being was one. born from a German, German scientist who proved that electricity can um, indeed... Uh, Frank eh, 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 it's Frankenstein's, Frankenstein's, Frankenstein's monster. Yeah. Who's Frankenstein's monster? Yes. Eric got it right. <laughs> Frankenstein's monster. Not Frankenstein. That's a scientist. Jason, you, or Tony, you don't ask. <laughs> well, I don't fucking read this shit. <laughs> All right, Eric, you get the next one. <laughs> Hestia slash band inside joke for 100. Why are you really mad at me for what? For, for how much? 100. First a quote. What about the blank attack on the blank? What about the joint attack on the walking? <laughs> yes, you <laughs> got the right. God damn. Of course Jason knows <laughs> it. <laughs> All right, Jason. You get the next one. Uh, music 500. Music Muzak. 500. The arrangement of accidentals at the beginning of a staff. This indicates the pitches that would be a common a piece of music. Key. What is a tuning fork? No, bitch, it's a key. No. <laughs> All right, Eric, your answer is key, correct? Yeah. All right, yeah, Ryan, what's your answer? Key. Uh, key. Huh. It's the yeah, it's the key. It's but you, if, I I got it right. Just oh my god. All right, Tony, what's your answer? Uh, scale or key? I don't know. I shouldn't. You're have. wrong. The answer is key signatures. No. Wait. Oh yeah, oh, it, it is key. Yeah, signatures. he's right. He's it right. Oh, no, right. you got it right. 
All right. Oh my, these are actually fucking hard. This is pretty good. <laughs> okay. Uh, Jason, since you got the last one right, you get the next one. Um. Shit. Um. Uh, <laughs> Choose wisely. Two hundred. Uh, which one? Two hundred. Inside jokes for two hundred. Inside jokes for two hundred. Okay. Finish the phrase. Neko. Neko butt. Neko butt. What is Neko butt? No, I said it. Uh, did Eric? Tony said. Tony said. Tony said it. Fuck. Tony said it first. Okay. Yeah. Neko butt. All right. Tony, you get to choose the next one. Okay. Um, Gamer Zone three hundred. Gamer Zone three hundred. If you're shit at a game, don't worry. Just blame blame. And the controller. Keyboard. Uh, Eric said controller. Ryan said... Nothing. <laughs> Jason um, said... Keyboard. Or Windows. Tony said... Or I said controller. Well, the controller. <laughs> Blame Linux? <laughs> no, you're all wrong. Blame <laughs> lag! Blame lag! I, I said controller, oh, and, then I, and then I was like, fuck, he's gonna say lag. Alright, Tony, you get the next one. Um... I'm not. I'm not doing math 100. That's just the. That's just fucking. We all sell that one. Um, fuck. Let's see who has to inside band jokes. Uh, 300. Oh God. Has a solid. Ryan. Band eh, what, is Ryan? what is Ryan? Ryan. What is Ryan? Ryan? What is what is me? I, think... <laughs> I said it. I, I said it. I said. I know. I said it. No, I did. Uh, I, I got said it first. Said it. I, said it. I think Eric said, said it first. It. So he gets it. All right, Eric, you get the next Eric, one. Guys, just don't want to do you. No, no, Eric got it first. I heard him first. Bitch. I'm so sweaty. Moose All right, Mo Eric, what's the next one? Muzak for 400. I knew that fucking joke was going to be in there. Brandon, An interval of four semitones between two different notes. Examples include C to E, G to B, D sharp to F. What is a key? What is a whole step? What is a, uh, okay. what is a half step? Half step. Half. Fuck! Jason, oh, what is wait, your answer? You're right. Oh, it it's a half step. I it's was gonna half say step. half I step. I said it. I said it. I get what it. It's a half step. Oh, it's I'm a half step myself. now. Well, Jason, what's your answer? Uh, Sorry, I didn't hear you. Oh, I don't know. The interval of four semitones. It's a uh, half step. I don't know. Yeah, it's a half uh, step. Okay, so y'all got it wrong. It's a major. Fuck. Oh, major. Well, I didn't take music theory. Oh, oh my god. Neither did I. I'm gonna whack my head. <laughs> For listening to me. Alright, uh, who got the last oh, one? I got the- I still got la- oh. I still got the last okay, one. Okay, um... Jason, are you watching the stream? Spoo- sp Yeah, it's a delay on Twitch, so... No, okay. watch, watch, watch in the chat, watch, watch in, 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 in Discord. You can watch in Discord. He's sharing his screen. Alright, what is the next? Um, I'm gonna clip that to prove that I'm not a boomer anymore. <laughs> spooky, scary questions for 400. This girl was a daughter of a cult priestess who was groomed by the cult to birth a new god, and is the cause of all the haunting that occurred in the town of Salem Hill. Who is Salem? The fuck? Um, I don't know any of this. Silent Hill is what I said. Who is Salem? Okay, Ryan, what's your answer? I don't fucking know. I've never played Silent Hill. Jason, what's your answer? It's cause of the haunting that occurred in the town. Oh, I don't know this one. Nah. Uh, Tony, what's your answer? These nuts. <laughs> I really wish Dan was here. Therefore, he would have got this correct. Alessa Gillespie would also accept Cheryl Mason or oh. Heather Mason. Oh my God. Okay. All right. What's your uh, Brandon? You spooky, you scary down. questions for one hundred. The spookiest day of the year. Halloween. 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 What is Halloween? Halloween. I said. It. I said it. No, Ooh, I said or tax day. Tax fucking day. hate you. <laughs> okay, no, Brandon, God, no, no, no. This, this game is fucking rigged. You're a dick. <laughs> no. Okay, okay, I'll, fine. I'll accept Halloween. Who got that? I did. I said oh, I did. Yeah, no, I did. boy, no, I did. I, I did. I said. <laughs> I know I did. You all get it. You all get it. That was a cheap move. You all get it. You all get it. All right. Thank you. Dog champ, dude. You bitch. All right. On the fucking board. <laughs> all right, Eric. What's the, what's the next one? Math for 100. What nine is, plus 10. What, what, what is 21? <laughs> it's 9 plus 10. 21? 21? Yeah! yeah. You said 21. <laughs> I said back to kindergarten. So back to K to you. Wait, I said it though. You said kindergarten? I said no, no I said 19. I said 19 first. 
Oh my fucking god, mate. Well, no, rock, paper, it. scissors. Who, who, let's see. Let's see. We can't do we we can't can't rock, paper, rock, paper, paper, scissors. scissors. <laughs> All right, fine. Ryan got it. Whatever. Thank um, you. All right, Ryan, what's the next one? You have to Hestia give him the points. Bad jokes for 400. He did. Oh. Okay. The name of the band's first iteration with the asshole singer. What is locked what? out? What is Ron to the core? No, what is locked out? It was Ron to the core was before locked out. Oh, fuck. I, I think I, I got this wrong. I got this wrong. Um, it, it was right to the core, then it was locked in, and then it was locked out. Jason, what's your answer? Wait, who's the asshole singer? Who Matt. do you think? <laughs> uh, oh. Uh, so, I got the answer wrong. My fault. The message to his face to music. Glad you switched the name before Bill and Ted 3 came. <laughs> uh, core is technically... Right. No, answers, so the, I'm no, giving the, Eric the point. No, Face the Music was the first of the three band, three member band. Yeah, uh, yeah, the, but yeah, I, band, I, yeah, so you still got it. Wrong. I got it wrong. Yeah, he got it wrong. Yeah, I got and it right. Eric got it right. Also, I wasn't Anyways, there for the first name. Eric, what's the next one? Second. Um, has to be a band inside jerks for five hundred. The heaven sent Asian god. Who Bro, what is Bourbon home. Chicken Man? What is Bourbon Chicken Man? <laughs> Chicken Man okay. is <laughs> okay. Okay. Can we can we explain to our audience what Bourbon Chicken Man okay. is? Okay. I want to do it. I want to do it. So there's this guy at the Oxford Valley Mall who gives out oh. test oh, samples for Bourbon Chicken, right? I know this guy. And he Shut does this. Up. He he. It's this Asian dude, and he does this stereotypical accent. It's it's <laughs> it's funny. And he's he so goes, he goes around, funny. yeah, he goes around and he, he points at people. He's like, Bubba Chicken, Bubba <laughs> Chicken is so good. Make your pee pee hard. Like your he, hard. he just goes around and does that to people it, and gets people like to chase the bourbon girls, chicken. Wait, didn't want a bunch of te uh, teenage girls walk up to him and then he stopped because he turned like bright red. <laughs> <laughs> wait, I didn't, I didn't know that. Oh no, your your back was turned. Oh. I was the one facing it. I'm like, oh my <laughs> god. Bubba Chicken. Bubba Chicken. Bubba Chicken. Bourbon Chicken Man is an Asian god. We and also said is. we were going to write a song for him. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Look Whoever you are, Bourbon Chicken Man, you deserve yes. everything in this world. Gotcha. Yeah. All right. Press, press God's easy, grace. Please. Was this before COVID? Yes, this yes. was yes. before COVID. This is like right before COVID. All right, um, Eric, next one. Gamer Zone for 100. Tony oh. worships? Is it? Oh, uh, what is Ari? Ari. What, who is Ari? Who is Ari? Who is Ari? Ari. 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 The way you phrased this, dear fucking god. <laughs> so if anybody's in Tony's class watching this right now. <laughs> if you're in my class, I'm fucking sorry. <laughs> give, the points, give the points to Tony just for pity. Yeah, <laughs> just for know. pity. All right, pity points well, to Tony. I'm clearly a fucking disappointment. All right, oh my all right, god. All right. And also another pity move. Um, I'm why, you get to choose the next one. <laughs> wow, I choose death. Oh my god. That is not an option on this board. <laughs> a, I don't Anywho, see it on um, this board. Uh, math, Tony, math, I'm sorry I didn't get a chance to review the board. Math, I'm serious. No, 200. 2x equals 6. What is x? Uh, x three. is 3. Tony got it right first. Fuck. So Oof. I will give him points. Ma uh, math, math teachers will argue, oh, but you had to state what x is. Hey, go fuck you yourself. Just fucking <laughs> did. No, I said uh, 3. Not I X said, is three. I said X is three. Yeah, that's, that's what we just did. <laughs> um, anyways, um, next one. Uh, Muzak 200. A six-string instrument that's not a guitar. Fuck. <laughs> oh, the guitar. No, not a guitar, dumbass. <laughs> guitar. No, we said... Um... Gent? I don't know no, that's like eight strings plus. <laughs> no. All right. It's um, the what is... string bass. It's the thing that George Harrison. Yeah. Tony. <laughs> you bitch. Oh you bitch. I wanted to say six string bass, but I didn't. I think you were gonna. Uh, all right. Dick about Tony, it. You got it right. A harp. No. No. no a, li like a, a liar. Harp a liar. A liar. What is a liar? No, I just already answered. It's a six what? No. Bass. What is a liar? You're lying to me. What is a liar? A, a bass is technically a guitar. All right. Yeah. Um, a bass is technically a guitar. What is a liar? <laughs> yeah, dumbass. <laughs> I guess gamers on 200. 
Gamer Zone 200. Well, Commonly used Call of Duty as PSGO technique involving sniper rifles. A weird measure stick for video game talent. PSGO 360. No, yeah. MLG? What? No, what is a 360 no scope? Uh, fuck. Um, okay, that's your, that's your, Ryan, what is your answer? Wait, is that the I, I said, I said three, yeah, I said no scope 360, but basically it's kind of the same thing. It's Jason, not. what is your answer? Proper. I only use Call of Duty CSGO 360. I just said it backwards, asshole. <laughs> You see uh, a lot of guys in MW2 doing this. Quickscope, yeah. Quickscope. He totally uh, got it right. It's quickscope. Why is it not showing up? Uh, I didn't get it right. I just said MLG. I said quickscope. Huh. You know, you just said quickscope. Yeah, sorry for it. Jason gets the answer. And why yeah. is it not? Why it's not showing up? I don't fuck. You said you said Tony got it right when it was Jason. Yeah, you got it right. Yeah, Jason got it right. Uh, Jason, what's the next one? The next one is, um, music for three hundred. This drummer pleaded guilty in a New Zealand court for the charge of threatening to kill a man who used to work for him. He also pleaded guilty on possessing marijuana, methamphetamine, and marijuana. What is this point if you know what band he is from? What is, is it the drummer from ACDC? I can't remember Ryan, his name. Ryan, you got bonus points. Uh, what is his name? What, what is Rudd? What is Rudd? Who is Rudd? Phil Rudd. Who is Rudd? Rudd? That's me, Harry bitch. First. This is me, bitch. Let's yeah, but go. I said, his, I said his full name. But you get... No, but he, you already said it when it was already up. I said he's going to get individual Wait, bonus points. So I'm going to give you one. So I'm going to give you 100 bonus points for guessing the band. First. Wait, okay. tell me the story. What, what happened there? There, that was uh, the story. <laughs> oh fuck. Uh, okay. Um. So Ryan, Eric, this is a species of the alien that haunts and picks off the crew of the USS. USS what is the xenomorph? Correct. Boom. Fuck you guys. <laughs> Anyways, next one. Uh, gamer zone for 400. In order to go above 16 gigs of random access memory for a desktop computer, you have to you have this <laughs> other word compatible, compatible with this kind of dedicated memory. DDR4. Uh, yeah, what correct. Is DDR4. DDR4. <laughs> correct, Eric. All right. Well, I don't know why I didn't Next get one. that right. <laughs> uh, gamer, uh, math, yes, I'm serious for 400. What is the derivative of cosine of 2x? Oh, fuck you, you man. I uh, hate one half. Asshole. What is one half? All right. It is. It, I hate right, what's your answer? I don't fucking know. <laughs> Jason, what's your answer? I have no idea. All right, Brandon, Tony. you're a dick. Hey, I, fu <laughs> I, fu I fucking thought for sure I got away from trigonometry. What is one half? Uh, yeah, it's one half. It's a wrong. Half. It's negative two sine two x. It's not. I fucking hate not, this shit. It's this not is, a fucking answer. It's a fucking derivative, is, dude. I All know right. it's trig, and it fucking Fuck sucks. All right, two uh, two ones. Um, uh, math. Yes, I'm serious for three hundred. If x minus seven equals fifteen, what is x plus four? Fuck. Um. Uh. It is uh twelve. Uh, okay. Are you sure about that? Wait. Hold on. Wait. No. It's not that. It's fucking six, negative six. No, wait, no, wait, no, it's not. What are you it's on not. about? It's, it's negative four. I'm doing it too quickly. Okay, what? Eric, what's your answer? <laughs> Bitch, oh fuck you. Oh my god. Um, what, it, what is negative eight? And then x plus four, hold on. The x is negative eight, so then it would be, what is negative four? Okay, Ryan, what's your answer? So my final answer is negative four. Same. Ryan, what's your final answer? I want to go negative four too. All right, Jason, what's your ne negative answer? Four. We all said negative eight. Negative eight. <laughs> is an X equals negative eight. That's ah. what I said. But you, you, you didn't ask what X was. You asked what X plus four is. Brandon. X plus four is negative. Oh. Oh fuck. my oh, God. Fuck. Brandon. All right, you all get points. You all, you all get, you all get points. Dumb. You all get points. You all get points. All right. Last one. Gamer Zone for 500. What is the greatest game of all time? What is Halo. right or wrong? Halo. What, what is, what is, Halo? what is, what is Halo 6 Cursed Edition? What is Halo, what is Halo 3? What is Halo 6? What, what, what is Halo 2? What is Halo 2? Jason, what's your answer? Uh, Battlefront 2, 2005. Shut the fuck uh, up. Tony, what is your answer? Halo 6, but it's incredibly cursed. Uh, you're all wrong. It's Halo Combat Evolved. No, actually, you're, actually you're wrong. It's you're wrong. It's Pokemon Emerald. 
Get the fuck out of here. Actually, you're wrong. No, 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 no. Anyway, that's no. it. Jeopardy! <laughs> Actually, you're all wrong. It's yeah, Jason's yeah, Pokemon yeah, yeah, yeah. game. Pokemon breaking it. Yay! Yay! Pikachu. That was happened earlier. Cringe. I don't see anyone getting offended over the names of We're demonic. We're not saying it again. No. Not no, 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 no. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, not saying, we are not I'm not, about this on stream. I, I'm, I'm not, not saying like, people would get offended. I'm saying that there is robots that monitor this shit. Yeah. So what we're going to do in poster, and by what we're going to do, I mean, Eric, he's going to censor that shit. God, that's just more. I might, look, <laughs> I'm, I, I'm, I might just take Don't the leap right now. This is like fucking sketch as fuck right now for me. I, 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 I can't. You want to stick around for creepy pasta? I would, but I, uh, I can't. Don't worry, I'm not spelling the names of. No, no, I, 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 I understand. I'm just gonna go. What did Brandon say? They triggered Tony. No, he didn't say anything. I'm just gonna go. Oh, um, right. what happened? Okay. I'll tell you later. Did All I miss right. something? You did. <laughs> you did miss something, and I know exactly no, what it is. No, I, I saw the question Jason Brandon Jason was too did. busy pre playing Breath of the no, Wild. No, 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 I saw the question Brandon did. I didn't get it, though. It was just something. So. <sighs> I thought it was from okay. a movie or something. It anyway, it moving on. on. Um, all right. So. Ad break? Not quite. I have one last oh. segment that I want to do before we get to the creepy pasta. I interviewed a bunch of people that don't play video games, and I asked them <laughs> to define. I asked them to define certain terms that are used within video games to see what they would come up with. So here are the answers that I received. Proc, the official definition, is to activate or use an ability. A lot of people did, were able to get this right. The answers were push or optimize, improve or achieve, to use, have access, or to use or gain. So that one was fine. I got gank, to come in from the side, an unexpected attack, or, or to help out someone else by unexpectedly attack. That's the official definition, or that's the definition that's most commonly used. Um, answers, a good player move, suggestion or critique. Frontal assault, which is completely incorrect, to shank. Fuck you. This is my favorite. To shank. <laughs> it gets better. Or to give someone a shank as a gift. Okay, we're not going to name drop, but <laughs> can you like DM me who said that? <laughs> yes, I can. Because I have a strange feeling I know who it might have been. <laughs> Fuck, I might have shown DMs, but it's fine. Um, Don't worry, you didn't show anything lewd. So, so, um, actually they said that they were fine with a name drop, so I'm just going to say it. Uh, actually, you know what? No, because of the amount of shit that's ha happened on this podcast, I am not going to name drop anyone. Yeah, um, no, we're not going to name drop anyone. That's right, what I'm asking then, for you to fucking DM me. I will later, okay? Right. Um, and then the final answer was a boost. Moving on to the next one, boosted. The official <laughs> definition is so bad that the only way they can be playing with you is that they play, they paid someone to play to get to the rank they are. Hey, answer. I got a fun fact. I got banned from Xbox for boosting. <laughs> for, uh, oh my yeah, God. I got banned for two week, or three weeks. Oh my for, God. Uh, you, you, you heard know it here it, first. You know, you know Jason's it, a cheater. You, you know in Korea you can get arrested for boosting. You cut out. <laughs> you cut out. You know, I, I said Korea. I said in Korea you can get arrested for boosting. Oh shit. Yeah, like it's an actual legal offense. It's interesting. Um so the answers I received was maximized, over the top, motivated, hardworking. It's a complete opposite of what boosted means. Level goes up. No. Cocky or high. Or both at the same time. Possibly. <laughs> um, achieved or advanced. Which is also the complete opposite. Um, backdoor. 
getting your enemies to become so aggro they forget about their base while you send a teammate to win the game. That is the meaning of backdooring. Answers. A lot of people got this correct. Um, yeah, because it, it, it's kind of like a common term. A strategy but... to blindside your opponent, their error or loss, flanking from behind. That was my Se answer. A secret way to win the game. No one sees it coming. Hacking or cheating. Hacking and cheating is not included in backdooring, but you can yeah, cheaply no. win the game by backdooring. All right, we're going to go for a quick ad break.
We'll be back in just a second. Sorry for the wait. Um, in the meantime, don't forget that we are currently uh, we are currently running a fundraiser for mental health. You can check the link below. It is in the description or it's in the about page of my channel. You can go ahead and click that and you can donate to the fundraiser. It is in partnership with Heart Support. It's an online community that helps people with depression, anxiety, eating disorders, and all the above. Um, please help out as much as you can. We're trying to reach $100 by the end of the month. We'll see you in just a few moments. We are going to be getting back to the podcast in just a second. Um, get ready for the random bullshit that you are used to. Thank you. Please stay seated and fasten your seatbelts for this bumpy ass ride. <laughs> Welcome okay. back, everyone. We're okay. So Yo. basically, Eric has landed the plane. We are now embarking on our fucking one way ticket to Brazil, and we're going to be reading some creepy pastas. Um, I don't. I'm not, not even so the fuck. <laughs> is Brandon here? Uh, yes, he is. Yes. All right. Sounds like a grandiose old time. Yeah. Brandon, bring up that fireplace and let's get this creepy pasta on the All road. All right. <laughs> All right. Now everyone, shut the fuck up and mute yourself. Yep. All right. Fireplace 4K. Is this the video? That's the video. This is it. All right. Here we go. Well, he found. Uh, I'm not sure I can keep this running while. Well. I will give you your count off. Oh. Uh, All right. Please. I don't think. I... Give me a second. Did you say Actually, you... I can't do the fireplace now because I have to share. Like, if I, I can probably try to like share a separate wait, 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 wait. tab. Yeah, just share the separate tab. There we go. Are you guys only yeah. seeing the fireplace tab? No, you need to separate the tab out. You need to drag it. You All need right. To drag Are you guys still seeing the fireplace? Yes, I'm still seeing the fireplace. Okay, cool. Okay, good. All right, we got it set up. All right. Hopefully I can keep my wits together for this. Um, after, well, let's not talk about it now. Um, this is a creepypasta that I really liked called the strangest security tape i have ever seen now with a title like that <laughs> you're expecting something pretty um 
not that good. <laughs> but um, please, uh, let's not judge a little creepypasta by its cover. And uh, let's get through this, shall we? <laughs> let's um, read a preview pasta called The Strangest Security Tape I've Ever Seen. I work at a gas station in rural Pennsylvania, represent. It's a boring job, but it's pretty easy, and it pays all right. A few weeks ago, this new guy started. We'll call him Jeremy. Jeremy is weird. He's about 25 or 26, and he hardly speaks, but he's got the creepiest laugh I've ever heard. The boss and I have noticed this, but it's never been a problem. So there's not much we can do about it. Customers have never complained about him. He, he's always done his job fairly well, up until a few weeks ago anyway. That's when things started going missing. Employee theft can be a problem at any business that sells customer goods. And there's only one person working at a time at this gas station. It's a pretty small place. About two weeks ago, my boss started noticing that we were pretty short on motor oil. At first, it was a few containers at a time. Then entire shelves and boxes in the back room. Pretty soon, entire shipments would be gone the day after we got them. And it'd always be right after Jeremy shifts. My boss has checked the security camp tapes from every single night he worked. But we could never catch him in the act. Jimmy, Jeremy was simply lock up at closing, and the motor oil would be gone next day. The boss usually takes the tapes home with him and try to catch Jeremy stealing. But his daughter had a softball game last night, so he asked me to watch the tape for him. He offered to be pay me overtime under the table, so I obviously took that offer. There are three t cameras, so he gave me three different tapes to check. I figured it would be a long night, but I'm trying to save up for vacation, so I really needed the money. So I took the tapes home, popped up with an old VCR, and sat back. Two years ago, which is the last time I worked. <clears throat> sorry. Uh, two days ago, which is the last time Jeremy worked. Uh, Jeremy started at 4 p.m. Everything seemed pretty normal at first. He canned up his drawer, switched off with the girl who was working before him, and waited for the customer. The first person came in was Mrs. Templeton. The timestamp for the video read 403. A regular. She picked up her cigarettes and newspaper and paid with a 20. Nothing usual there. The next customer was some local guy named Ron. He drives a motorcycle. He usually comes in every few days. He filled up his tank, got a bag of beef jerky, paid with his credit card, and then left. The next guy was next was some guy with a cowboy hat. I've never seen him before. But we got plenty of strangers passing through, just like any gas station. He got $40 worth of diesel fuel, paid with a $100 bill, and went on his way. I sat back and la sighed. The only thing more boring than this job is watching someone else do it. My boss's offer was enough to keep me watching, though, so I left the tape on. Everything seemed pretty normal. I had a feeling that, I had a feeling that if Jeremy was stealing the motor oil, he knew we were suspicious of him by now. I didn't expect him to be dumb enough to catch us, let us catch him on camera. Things stayed around boring until 5 o'clock. At 5.03, Mrs. Templeton came back in. She must have forgotten something, but she didn't. She bought the same pack of cigarettes as before and the same newspaper. She paid with another 20. That's odd, I thought. But then again, she's a little absent-minded. I thought Jeremy should have told her she already got her smokes, but it's not against the rules to sell something the same thing twice. Then Ron came in again. He bought another tank of gas for his motorcycle again. I let her check the outdoor camera because I thought I maybe had another car he wanted to fill up. And the same pack of beef jerky. He paid with his credit card again. No big deal. I just figured it was a weird coincidence. Mrs. Templeton was, all, was forgetful, and Ron probably owns more than one Harley. That's when the guy when the cowboy hat came back in. I felt a chill run down my spine. Don't get diesel. Don't get diesel. Don't get diesel. I found myself whispering in my empty living room. But he did. He got $40 worth of diesel fuel and paid with another $100 bill. Every move he made was identical to his first visit, right down to the way he scratched his nose before he walked out. Either this guy is rich, owns a lot of trucks, and just moved into town, or something really bizarre as was happening. I kept watching. Every customer for the next hour was the same as before. Every single one. I was seriously freaked out. And then at 6.03, Mrs. Templeton walked back in. She bought her cigarettes and newspaper again and paid with a 20 again. 
I thought I was going to lose it. I only watched at another half hour before I started fast forwarding through the rest. It was all the same. Every customer would come up at the exact same times, exactly one hour apart. I know what you're thinking. That sneaky motherfucker Jeremy had messed up the tapes. He had won a loop of his first hour of business over and over. That wasn't the case. There were windows around the catch register that were there were windows around the catch register that area that were camera covers. And I watched the sunlight fade as time ran on. Jeremy's routine didn't loop over. He swept, moped, restocked, and did all of his duties exactly how you would expect. But the same customers just kept coming in. I was panicking at this point. Something was seriously wrong with what I was seeing. I had no explanation for it. I just skipped ahead and whenever he was locked up and walked out of his car. He hadn't stolen anything, but I kept watching, just to make sure. I fast-forwarded the time to about midnight. At exactly 12.03, out of nowhere, Jeremy's face pops up as a camera. I didn't even mean his head... Sorry, I'll read that line real quick. At exactly 12.03, out of nowhere, Jeremy's face pops up at the camera. I don't mean he moved his head into view. I mean that one second the store was empty. Next second, his face was all I could see. He wasn't looking at the camera. He was looking at me. I was sure of it. I screamed and fumbled for a remote. By the time I grabbed it, he was gone. Just as soon as he left. One frame was there, the next few wasn't. My hands were shaking like crazy, but I popped in another tape. The indoor camera shows the back area by the cash register. And I'll be able to see how he got his, put his face on the camera like that. I skipped, my, I skipped ahead at 12.03, but there was nothing. I wouldn't be able to see him standing on a chair or something on this on the tape, but he wasn't there. I didn't see him enter the store at all after he left. It was like he really wasn't there. He doesn't know the security code, so no alarms were triggered at night after he locked up. What I did see, however, is that at 12.03, motor oil vanished off the shelf. All of it. Same as Jeremy's face. God damn it, guys. <laughs> Same as Jeremy's face. One second it was there, and the next it wasn't. I turned the tape off and went to bed. But I didn't get a wink of sleep. Okay. My body was exhausted right now, but my mind is racing. That tape was undoubtedly the creepiest, most disturbing thing I have ever seen in my life. I work in a few hours. My boss asked me to bring the tapes back and let him know what I found. But I really... What the hell am I going to say? Germany works a night shift tonight, directly after me. So the plan is for my boss to come in and just before I leave and just confront him with me. I'm supposed to be the one who caught him stealing. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm going to do. I was supposed to have to show my boss tapes, but I don't want him to watch them with him. I never want to see something like that again. I can't get the image of Jeremy just smiling directly in the camera out of my mind. It was the creepiest look I have ever seen on another human being's face. Anyway, I'm going to try to get some last minute sleep before I have to go deal with this. All you guys know what happens. Update. 2, 49 p.m. Updating from my phone. Apologies in advance for the errors. My boss just finished watching the last of the tapes. I told him what to expect, but you really can't prepare someone for something like that. He's scared shitless. I still am too. And Jeremy is due to come in at 4. We got a little over an hour to get our shit together, but none of one of us is, knows what he's going to say to him. He's just a fucked up guy who likes stealing motor oil and scared of living shit out of people? Or is it something else? I don't know if this is crazy, but someone, but does anyone think he could have anything to do with this time loop? But boss said he never noticed anything like that on the other tapes, but the way he popped up on this one made me think he knew I would be watching. It's like he wanted me to see what he could do, like he was showing off or something. The way he he smiled into the camera. It was like a little kid showing you a sandcastle he just built or something like that. I don't know. I probably sound crazy. I sure feel the part. I'm going to talk to my boss some more. We have to calm ourselves down and figure out how to handle this. I'll update again tonight. But I don't, but I have a really bad feeling about how this is going to play out. Update 4 33 p.m. No sign of Jeremy. Tried calling him, but his phone has been disconnected. We're calling the police. Update, 5.33 p.m. No sign of Jeremy. Tried calling him, but his phone has been disconnected. We're calling the police. 
Update, 6.33 p.m. No sign of Jeremy. Tried calling him, but his phone has been disconnected. We're calling the police. Update, 7.33 p.m. No sign of Jeremy. Tried calling him, but his phone has been disconnected. We're calling the police. Update, 8.33 p.m. No sign of Jeremy. Tried calling him, but his phone has been disconnected. We're calling the police. Update, 10.58 p.m. Holy shit, holy shit, holy shit, holy shit, holy shit. I just got home and saw my previous updates. The things make less sense now more than ever. Here's what I can tell you. I went to work. Jeremy never showed up. My boss and I decided to call the police, as I'm sure you're well aware. But I just, when I decided to pick up the phone call, though, the sun went out. I shit you not. That's what I thought happened. Apparently, I blacked out for exactly five hours because when I looked at the clock, it was 9.33. I think I got stuck in Jeremy's time loop. And then I snapped out at the exact point I blacked out. But that makes sense. But that's when things got really weird. My boss was right next to me when I blacked out, ready to collaborate with my story to the cops. When I came to, the phone was in my hand, but it was dead. Not even a dial tone. My boss was still right there, but he wasn't moving. He was just standing up, frozen. I looked at the clock again when it wasn't moving. The second hand was stuck at 12. It was 9.33 exactly. The clock on the register, computer screen, wasn't moving either. My phone was frozen. There was even a customer at the register waiting for my boss to get him cigarettes. I'm betting that it would have been his fifth pack for the day. I got the fuck out of there. Didn't even lock up. Didn't turn the lights on. Sorry, guys. Then I grabbed security tape, stopped loading the internet. Believe me, that's the last thing on my mind. The gas station was on a major highway, and the cars were parked along it. Even Except they weren't parked. They were all just frozen. People inside sitting still as wax statues. I got in my car and prayed it would start. Thankfully, it did. About halfway home, time started up again. The stack from the radio turned into music, like it was supposed to be. And from what I could tell by listening to the host talking between the songs, no one noticed the time freeze or whatever it was. I was the only one. Well, I'm sure Jeremy noticed it as well. I still have no clue where he is or what the hell he's doing. I'm hiding in my room and calling the police again in the morning. I don't know if I ever got through to them before, or if I did, whether they took me seriously. I'm scared for my life at this point. I'll update tomorrow if I can. Final update, 3.33 a.m. I finally fell asleep last night around 4. I have no idea how I did it. I guess exhaustion finally got the mess to me. This morning, I woke up with my phone ringing. It was my boss. He'd been calling me about since about 6. He woke up when time turned back on last night and immediately called the cops. They came by me and saw what was wrong, and he told them everything. The police around here are all small-time guys. They were more concerned about the missing motor oil than anything, but my boss figured he would take it, as long as he had their attention. They they decided to go look for Jeremy. He kept all of our employees' applications on file, and since Jeremy started working here, he was easy to find. They checked his address and on it and headed over to his house. You're not going to believe what they found. The address Jeremy listed on his application was an empty lot, or at least now it is. There used to be a house there, but it burned down in 1993. Being a small town, almost everyone remembers that fire. A family of four used to live there way back when. Rumor has it that it had been a strange son that never, ne- that, who they never really talked about, but I can't feel sure if that's true. What I can say is true is that after an insurance investigation, the fire was ruled as arson. The entire house was soaked in oil and torched with a Molotov cocktail. The entire family was sleeping when it happened. None of them survived. They never caught the guy who did it. Rumor has it that they tried to contact the estranged son, but no one could find him. Anyway, my boss called and told me about this, and I freaked out. Then he asked me to come to the gas station. What, are you crazy? I said. But he assured me that the cops were here with him. Then he dropped the bomb. The FBI were in town, and they were going to talk to me one way or the other. So I might as well come in. It's about 7.15, and I want to go back to bed. But I figured I wouldn't be able to sleep as much anyway, so I went down. Four men in suits greeted me and told me to have a seat. They went over everything and two or three times until they got all the details down. I told, 
them about Jeremy. The security tape, last night at work, everything. Finally, after I finished, one of them agents said, oh, Christ, we got another one on our hands. They, made me, they then made me sign a bunch of papers saying I wouldn't tell anyone about what happened, so I can't say much more. I might be breaking the law just by posting this. So now I'm home. I'm not sure what to do about myself. That agent's words when I told him the story are going to haunt me for the rest of my life. Anyways, I gotta go. I have some errands to run today. Then I have to go to work and pick up some tapes. My boss and I think this new guy, Jeremy, he's a complete creep. He's stealing motor, oil, stealing motor oil, and I have to watch some security footage to see if I can catch him doing it. I have better things to do, but my boss is paying me overtime under the table, and I'm trying to save up for a vacation that I could really use the money. It should be pretty simple. Oil, the oil goes missing right after his shifts. I just have to wash the tapes, catch him in the act, and that will be that. All right. There we go. That was a short one. Hey, keep awesome. All right. That was really good. All right. Cool. All right, guys. Thank you for joining the podcast. Let me unmute the rest of the cast. All right. Thanks for joining the podcast. Go ahead and say your last few words. Hey, we didn't mention it earlier, but we do have that charity still going on. Be sure right, to click I that did. link and go donate. That's what the oh, announcement during the, the break was, yes. Oh, never mind. <laughs> but you can still go click that link and donate to the charity. Seriously, it's a good cause. Yes, it is. It's for mental health online. It's an online community that helps with depression, anxiety, eating disorders, all the above. Anything that they can help with. It's a really nice mm -hmm. charity. Uh, so go ahead say anything else you'd like to say you know, another drill if you're watching this on YouTube just like comment subscribe if you All dare right. yeah, make sure make sure to yeah. subscribe to Eric's YouTube channel hit that notification bell yes get subscribe that bell if you need to even if I'm incredibly inconsistent on YouTube uh, <laughs> stay in school oh, kids yeah, stay in school because obviously whatever the fuck I'm doing is not going to work <laughs> All right. Thank you all for joining my stream. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe on YouTube. Follow if you like the content here on, on Twitch. Uh, you can go see my you can go see my socials um, in the link below or description below if you're on YouTube. And remember, you will always have a home right here at the hearth. Thank you very much. Have a wonderful 